Did you try to build a React app with Vit? What about using React Query instead use effect to fetch data? If you don't, don't worry, I still use it. I shouldn't, but still. The real point is that I want to try to work with React a little bit differently. And also I want to show you what and how I did this project mixing React with Vit plus React Query plus Material UI. And don't forget I use Axios as well, but this is optional. The project's goal is to show two tables. The first one will show you the content that you are available to select, and the second one will show the elements picked from the first table. The first challenge was how am I going to fetch data with React Query? And I did it this way. Now the new challenge was how am I going to keep the element select when I change through pages? I got the fetch data as an array of objects, so the solution that I found was mixing map with sum. And if I want to remove the element select from table 1 or table 2, in this case I think it's necessary to use use effect to execute the method when the array is updated. But enough talking, let's see the project example to get a better idea about the approach. As you can see, the first table has the entire content, and once you select any element from it, this will update the second table. Pay attention to the interaction between them. You can see if you remove an element from the second one, it will be unpicked in the first one, and if you unpick an element on the first table, it will be deleted from the second table. Feel free to check the code on my repository, and also you can check the project in a static page using GitHub pages. Thanks for watching the video. See you later.